Well, I don't know why I came to my sister and brother-in-law for insight into my problem. You're dismissing Taylor's baby as unimportant and trivial? I'm sorry. I guess I shouldn't have come to you in the first place. Never mind. I'm going to have to handle this. I should be talking to no anyway, not you. <sighs> oh, sometimes it just doesn't pay to get out of bed in the morning. <sighs> what do you make of it? I don't know. I don't know. She's confused and I am worn out. I just want to go home and crawl into bed and not see Erica or deal with her or even acknowledge her existence. I've made arrangements. What, like concrete swim fins in her size? Better. Excuse me. Emma Gray. Alice, yeah. Uh, they have to be sent today, tonight. Um, listen, no, 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 don't send them to Wild Wind. The Valley Inn. Great. Okay, fine, thanks, Alice. Hey, we're not going home? No, we're not. <laughs> no, we're not. How does the Benjamin Franklin suite sound to you? Mmm. Overstuffed pillows, big bed, room service, movies, music, and best of all, the undivided attention of your Lord and Master. <laughs> yeah, but what about what Alice is sending over? Oh, I'll glance at it when we're napping. What do you say? I'll give you back rubs, I'll give you front rubs, I'll give you... Mm. Anything you want. And best of all, there'll be no Erica. Oh, boy, you really know how to spoil a girl. Yeah, well, you know, I, I try to be humble. You know what? Every once in a while, great while, I realize how very much I love you. I love you, too. Oh. I always will. Haley doesn't keep this on a keychain. Hello? Anybody here? No, of course not. The rest probably whisked her away to the South Seas, handcuffed.
Here we are. Hottest night of the year and you're cold. <laughs> Just nervous. You, you having second thought? Not about you. Just you have to remember, last time I was here, I became Mrs. Will Cortland. Haley, come here. Listen to me. I am not Will, okay? I'm Alec. And I'm the guy that, that worships you inside and out. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry. It's okay. But I do love you, and I can make you happy if you give me the chance. I will spend the rest of my life proving it to you. Now ring the bell. Let's make it official. You can't throw me out, Noah. Where would I go? You got a job, plastic, and a filthy rich mother. You can find your own place. You know I have been looking. I've scoured every paper, and I've, and I've followed every lead, and I can't seem to find anything decent that I can afford. You know I'm saving for the baby. Please, Noah, don't throw me out. Will you show me this place ain't big enough for the both of us? Look, I promise. I won't do one more thing to make you mad. I will be as good as gold. I just need time to build up my savings before the baby comes. I mean, and besides, where would I go anyways? You said you would help me. I ain't gonna sweat this much longer, Taylor. You won't even know I'm here unless you want to. May I stay, please? Only for now. Understand? Yes. You find someplace else soon. I will be as quiet as rose petals dropping into a jasmine-scented tub of hot water. you for making me feel this way. Ruin my life. Haley, you took my daughter. My only friend. My... We would have been the perfect mother-daughter relationship if only you hadn't... If we hadn't met you. Anybody home? Saw the light? 